Hi. Hi. It's, Hi. I'm, Liz, I'm Lizzie from Fangirlage, and it's great to see both of you. Great to see great you. Great to see you. The red looking good. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I, 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 I've been a fan of Vampire Academy since I, I read the books. It feels like when they came out. So this is very exciting. Um, and you are both playing like completely separate spectrums. Like Sonia is not interested in the politics and Victor is all about the politics of it all. So how, how is it approaching that, um, knowing that you still have to exist within the larger Vampire Academy world? Um, let's start with the ladies. <laughs> so Sonia Carp, you know, she kind of does her own thing. She she works in the library. She has a love interest, Mikhail. She goes on a journey and I can't talk much about it. You know, we know some things from the books. It may or may not happen. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> and you know the vampire genre is so fun yeah. because you you deal with issues that we can all relate to yet in this world of fantasy they just take on a, a fun energy um so my character as you said is a political animal he is obsessed with finding equality in this society that is so classist and he's at the top of the food chain as a royal vampire victor is and he just wants to see equality within this society you know that's a theme that i deeply relate to as a human being so it was pretty easy to get in the shoes of this character as far as that is concerned getting into the world of these you know beautiful castles like you see behind us yeah. and the beautiful costumes that were created for us that was more challenging but I loved the character very yeah. much I also read the uh, the books as a kid yay yeah see it's fun and you're sort of playing like every millennial's dream I feel like we all want to kind of be librarians right now and yeah. just not <laughs> talk to people <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> I really <That's> so funny. <laughs> um and in about Victor, I was sort of because you brought up how there's a metaphor about equality and about sort of that we usually get to see played out on TV in such a serious way. Yes. Um yes. that you can't escape it. Um and, and you and we're living it like and then in this you sort of get to take the metaphor and play the serious part while still not being really about you. So it's sort of refreshing. Very refreshing. I couldn't agree with you more. And, you know, the Dom peers who are in charge of, you know, um, guarding us, they're at the bottom of the food chain in this society. So it is fun. It's not too, you know, serious to watch Victor navigate this world between the queen and who's going to be the next um, monarch. And, you know, watching this political world, it's just fun. I think the show is very fun. Yeah, it is. In, in stepping into character, um, sort of, is it one of those things that when you put in, put on the costume, you are like before you were sort of it was vague, and then you put on the costume and you become the character. Yes, absolutely. And the set too, like uh, Sonia walking into the library, I felt like a li librarian. They were real books. They were real Spanish textbooks, and and history books and I did not understand them. They smelled very old and dusty. And it, so it's like that helped a lot. Everything that we did was, it wasn't just built, it was real. Like we were in a real church. We were in real, a, a Muslim mosque even like, it's just so cool. so cool. The first time we shot in our house, um, yeah. I was like, I have never <laughs> uh, played a character that, that would live in, in literally a castle. It's not a castle, it was an estate, but it felt like a castle. Everything was made of stone and, you know, the furniture and the furnishings were modern. So it had this amazing feel to it. And I was like, yes, this is me. This yeah. is how I need this to be living. living. And right. then, then when good. I had the costumes on, which were all handmade by Sonia Grande, um, wearing the costumes and being in that space totally informed for me who this character was. I've never stood up so straight in my life. Like I was so erect in my posture <laughs> and um my voice was so resonant you know so yeah it's definitely uh the world of the show is very unique yeah uh thank you so much for your time i i had a lot of fun talking to you guys and i watched the first two episodes and i really enjoyed them i hope people do too thank you thank, thank you. you so much have a good day